We live in a world full of beautiful and wondrous places. It's truly inspiring to experience these places firsthand and connect with nature. Washington State offers incredible architecture, magnificent art, and stunning landscapes that will inspire you for years to come. Fun new places full of friendly people and epic grand adventures await you in the city of Seattle and Washington's great national parks. Join us today as we explore some of the most breathtaking places in this geographically and culturally diverse state. I'm super excited for this trip because I've never been to the Pacific Northwest before and I'm really looking forward to seeing the mossy temperate rainforest and going on some amazing mountain hikes and maybe even seeing a whale. We're about to get on the plane so we'll see you in Seattle. Due to Gabby's work schedule we only have six days to make this trip but we're really going to make it count. We're going to start off in Seattle, then rent a car and drive to Olympic National Park and Mount Rainier National Park. We just arrived in beautiful downtown Seattle. It's a lovely evening here with a nice breeze. We're going to have a nice long walk through the city, go see the Space Needle, and find a place to eat dinner. Our first stop is the city of Seattle, and of course, one of the most famous places is the Space Needle. This observation tower, an icon of the city, is an official Seattle landmark. It was built in the Seattle Center for the 1962 World's Fair. The Space Needle features an observation deck providing views of the downtown Seattle skyline, the Olympic and Cascade Mountains, Mount Rainier, and various islands in Puget Sound. Visitors can reach the top of the Space Needle by elevators. Although the Space Needle is magnificent, the park surrounding it is perhaps even more fabulous. One of the absolute must-see museums is the Chihuly Garden and Glass, an exhibit right next to the Space Needle that showcases the fantastical glass sculptures of Dale Chihuly. The museum features three primary components, the garden, the glass house, and the interior exhibits. The colorful hypnotic glass sculptures will stir your imagination. The sculpture garden with its bright, fanciful mushrooms and winding plants made me feel like I was in Narnia. Thank you. It's a wonderful place to spend the afternoon enjoying the sculptures and fascinating museums. Space Needle Park area is a vibrant scene full of music, art, food, and family activities. You may even find a local yoga or Zumba class to join. It's wonderful to see families out having fun and connecting with their communities. Seattle is an incredible city full of art and beauty. Everywhere you go, you'll find spectacular sculptures and architecture intermingled with nature. It's a wonderful city for long walks and exploration. about Seattle is that the dining scene is absolutely out of this world. You can find amazing local breweries with creative flavors. I could spend a whole week just trying out all of the fish and chips places. Celebrated with beer. It's amazing. Old Stove Brewery and we got the Brewer's Plate. This is my favorite one, which is the Amber waves. That one. It's a really yeah. good beer. Cheers. Is it good? I didn't get to the fish yet. <laughs> Good. It's like flaky and fried and 
next video, we're going to visit the Mystical Olympic National Park, which is a three-hour road trip from Seattle. This is a truly magical place with astounding geographical diversity. We'll show you the Hurricane Ridge Trail with its imposing mountains, the mossy Ho and Quinault rainforests, and the iconic Ruby Beach. Thank you so much for watching today, and please remember to like and subscribe if you enjoy travel as much as we do. See you on our next video, and in the meantime, go out, live, explore, and make memories that will last a lifetime.